Hello YouTubers, it's the Awesome Builder over here and today I'm gonna give a review on the Conrad side and some uh, items. Today it's gonna be uh, the rail bedding from Cork, the rail track bed, you know, and uh, some banks and the uh, German word Schotterkleber. I'm Dutch and I um, uh, couldn't find it on the Dutch side so I bought it uh, from the uh, Conrad.de but yeah, let's unbox the whole box. This is the box. It's huge because these are my hands and my knees. Wow! But these are my hands, and yeah, let's unbox it. So just rip it off. And what you can see, it actually is a lot of fried air. I always call it. It's nothing. It's just bags with air. And here, three little articles. So it's an enormous box at place one. And uh, some cool things about this year, if you uh, just pinch it, it will... I will think that's quite fun. And yeah, let's get rid of this enormous box. There. And um, let's zoom in and I'm going to show you what I've bought. Okay, this is it. Um, three articles. This is from Core. This, these are the benches. Um, there's a sticker on it. And these are eight benches. And I'll use them later on. I've got no auto focus, so yeah. And um, this is a special kind of glue for the 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 ballast, like the the pieces of small coal you're putting on these ones, which is a three meters of um, um, track bed. And yeah, I'm gonna show you uh, if it works like the site says it will work, and if it really does bend. And uh, I I couldn't find it actually at the site properly explained so that's why I'm gonna help you guys with uh, your your thing before buying so yeah um, there's uh, three steps and step one will be the cork thing step two the glue for the ballast on the cork and step three the benches so um, let's go to step one okay I'm back I tidied everything up I unboxed the package and this was in some of these strips um, uh, five of them, which is has to be three meters. Well, six of them. I um, this just cork with one uh, saw roll in here, and you can um, split these from cutting it with a knife just along here, all the way to the end, and then you will get get over here two of these uh, cork strips with a angle at each side. I don't know if you can see it, but here this this one has an angle, and um, there is a manual in it. This one is in Dutch and in French, German. Well, I can read the Dutch part, but yeah, I read it, and I'm got I want to do from here and some out of here possibly up till here. You can't see it, but it's out of frame. But just just one corner. So. Um, Let's get started. The manual says you have to use um, some white glue, so that's what, why, what what I am going to get. Okay, I'm back. I've got my glue over here, and uh, I remove my blue mountain, the blue hills. Yeah, and um, I'm going to lay it from on here to up somewhere here where you can can't see it anymore. So um, yeah, that's what I want to do in this tutorial. So I take my glue. And it says in the manual. Oh. I haven't used this glue for a while and just throw some down here and I'll take a piece of of I need something to spread it a small brush I think this will do put my brush somewhere here and take the first layer of cork and some this. I don't know the word, it doesn't matter. Put the first one here, take the second one, follow the line, and this will go here. The line is going over here, so like this. Another needle.
and you put some all the way along here there has to be some more glue I can see so this there's no glue here and the other half we we'll need some more glue for that take another strip mine's the side right here and okay there we go okay up to where's the glue up to here okay I'll um, do the rest in time lapse with a nice music under it and I'll do all the way to here so let's do that Gangnam Style Gangnam Style Okay, that's it. Um yeah. This is the result. I did it um like this and the mountain will be like there with the port. So um I'll let it dry and return when it's completely dried I think and I'm back it's the next day over here and yeah this is the result I it is completely uh, tied tightened like this this just uh, there are some needles in it to, to hold the reel in place but yeah the rest is done and I'm gonna zoom in on a small part and I'm gonna lay some of the ballast uh, I've got it in the purple thing there there see yes Okay, so um, let's do that. Okay, so the manual of the shutter cleaver says that um, you have to throw in some ballast in the way you want it to be and then um, make a small hole with a needle or a, just a pin I've got here and um, just throw some on top of the shutter cleaver, on, on top of the, sh on the ballast. So uh, I'm gonna throw in some shutter over here. I'll do it in time lapse. So I found myself this spoon there's a small hole, I think it's from baby food or something because I found it deeply somewhere in a cupboard so yeah I'll do that Okay, I'm back and yeah, I did this piece and it used an awful amount of this stuff to keep it in place, um, especially on the on the the, 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 the the angles. So yeah, I'm just gonna do this part for now, and yeah, the rest will be in time. Let's, I am gonna do it with the shelter cleaver. So now I'm going to remove thing. Oh, I zoomed in too far. Oh, my mistake. Okay, better. Um. And it says that you have to use a pin to make a small hole on the top of this. And I don't want to cut into my fingers in front of the camera. I'm through. So yeah. Let's try this. Oh, it's really, it's, it's, it's really, um, I don't know the word. Okay, um, but yeah, you have to put something on top of the ballast and the ballast have to be in the place you want it to be so it's quite a lot of ballast I'm just gonna do the middle part for now okay that's it now I'm gonna do a part of the side there's not enough ballast at that corner so I'm gonna put some more there. Okay, I'm just gonna do one side for now. Okay, let's do this. Oh, I something at um something to definitely have some. Okay, well, rest of the sides. Okay, 
and there we go so I'm gonna use some drops just oh bubbles bubbles go away pop the bubble Okay, um, and this is it. Uh, I can see it worked pretty good because I can form it now a bit to the spots where there's no shutter, I think. I hope. Wow, some parts are almost hard or, or already. Well, um, as you can see, it worked. I think it's pretty cool. And, um, yeah, I'm gonna do the rest of it. And I enjoyed it. So that's part two. And last but not least, part three, the benches. Eight benches. Um, if you open the package, just folding this over, open, you get a plastic, four plastic pieces, a uh, very difficult manual, can you see it? Yes, I think you can. And uh, yeah, that's it. And you have to just cut all these sides off and the bench, the wood part, glue them together and you get a result and I'll show you right now.